Opposition to Aquila's Back 40, a mine project in Menominee County, Michigan, is growing. Protesters gathering along the Menominee River today after Michigan's Department of Environmental Quality approved two permits for the mine to go forward this week. NBC26's Eric Crest was at today's rally, and he has more for us. Members of the Menominee Nation and environmentalists alike gathered today along the Michigan-Wisconsin border in Marinette. Well, I think the message is, is, you know, standing in unity with our natural world, you know, our river, our, our animals and our plants here. The concerns on the minds of many. If we don't save this, it'll be gone, destroyed. Is the potential environmental impact that a mine upstream could have on the Menominee River as a whole. Sulfur just kills everything in the water, kills everything on the land. Um, it eventually will kill the animals because they eat drink from the land and drink from the water. Michigan's Department of Environmental Quality has already approved two permits for the mine to move forward, stating these decisions come after comprehensive and detailed reviews of the applications and careful consideration. But that doesn't sit well with many here. It would be naive to say that I didn't expect this. Uh, you know, Michigan's kind of a pro-mining state. And while the protesters likely have a long road ahead, going toe-to-toe -to -toe with a major corporation, they say they're in it for the long haul. Anything's possible. I think we can overcome them. And in the months ahead, these protesters say they plan on continuing their opposition and reminding others that the state of Michigan hasn't green-lighted the mine just yet. Keeping you connected in Marinette, I'm Eric Crest with NBC 26.